Le Premier ministre a souligné que le recrutement au sein de la Mauritius Police Force se fait à deux niveaux, à savoir au poste de policier temporaire et au poste d'officier cadet. Les candidats doivent répondre aux critères établis et passer une série de tests et un entretien mené par la discipline des Forces Service Commission, dit-il. That recruitment in the Mauritius Police Force is made at two entry levels, namely at the level of temporary police constable and at the level of cadet officer. For the post of temporary police constable, candidates have to meet the set criteria and have to undergo a series of tests and interview by the Discipline Forces Service Commission. Thereafter, the list of selected candidates is communicated to the Commissioner of Police for Enlistment. The temporary police constables then have to undergo a foundation course comprising six months training either at the police training school, the special mobile force, the special supporting unit, or the National Coast Guard, followed by six months on the job training Prior to their appointment as police constable. De 2015 à ce jour, la force policière a recruté 3461 aspirants policiers et 28 officiers cadets. Aucun recrutement n'a été effectué en 2020 en raison de la pandémie de la Covid-19, a précisé le Premier ministre. No recruitment was made in the year 2020 due to the Covid-19 pandemic. For the year 2021, 464 trainee police constables were recruited, out of which 370 were male and 94 were female. For the year 2022, 406 trainee police constables were recruited, out of which 308 were male and 98 were female, along with one cadet officer, male. And for the year 2023, 657 trainee police constables were recruited, out of which 548 were male and 109 were female, along with one female cadet officer. Pravin Jognot a également évoqué le programme de son gouvernement pour la période 2015 à 2009 qui s'était engagé à doter la force policière à Maurice d'un environnement propice avec des équipements modernes et de nouvelles technologies. As highlighted in my reply to parliamentary question B-1441 of 14th of November 2023, it is unfortunate that promotion in the Mauritius Police Force prior to the year 2014 was minimal, leading to demotivation and low morale of police officers, and thus impinging on service delivery and efficiency. For this reason, in our government program 2015-2019, we undertook to provide the Mauritius Police Force with inter alia a more conducive environment, modern equipment, and new technologies. Moreover, in our manifesto of 2019-2024, we pledge that police corporals and police constables reckoning at least 20 years of service would be promoted to the grade of police sergeant upon vacancies occurring. En ce qui concerne les promotions, un total de 4351 policiers ont été promus à des postes de haut gradé entre 2015 et 2023 et 2000 policiers depuis janvier 2024. I am informed by the Commissioner of Police that a total number of 4351 police officers have been promoted to higher ranks between 2015 and 2023. Furthermore, a total of 2,000 police officers have been promoted to higher ranks from January 2024 to date. A savoir que pour l'année 2024, des procédures de recrutement sont actuellement en cours pour recruter des hommes et des femmes policiers.